Okay, I'm playing Dragon Box. And the object of the game here is to get the box all by itself. We've got things going on on one side. We've got things going on on the other. It says here you can place a card below another card. So, it looks like, first of all, before I place it, that these two are together. They're next to each other. These are separate, so that must mean something else. And it says I can place a card below a card. So if I do that, it's almost like looks like I'm making a fraction. And it looks like it's telling me that if I have to do it there, I've got to repeat it for all the different things here. So now, if I get that all by itself, that's just a one. So that means that the box is all by itself. Okay, so I got it alone. I did it in the right number of moves, and I made the right number of cards. So this kind of tells me that I was really good at this. If I had an X here or an X here, that means that, yeah, I got it done, but it wasn't the most efficient in the way. So let's take a look here. I can place a card below a card. Whatever I do to one side, I've got to do to the other. These are the same, so they will cancel each other out. That becomes a one. That's just the same as the box. The box is all by itself. Yes. Let's try it again. I'm going to change it to make this the same, and I'm going to put it underneath here. Whatever I do to one side, it's forcing me. See this little indentation? It's telling me I, it has to go there. These two are the same. If I bring one up, it cancels each other out. That leaves it with one box. One times one. Great. Let's go on to the next one. Holy moly. Now it's dealing with dice. It's dealing with numbers. It's dealing with Maybe that would be considered a variable. Okay, so how do we get this box all by itself? First of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of that. 1 times 1 is going to be 1. A positive 1 and a negative 1 is going to be nothing. So I got rid of a lot. If I put this 5 under here as the denominator, i got to do it over there. Okay. This will cancel that out. Now I'm still left with this, whatever that is, a turkey or something. I'm going to put it under here. Whatever I do to one side, i got to do to the other. These are going to cancel each other out. There you go. Okay, I'm starting to get the hang of this. I'm starting to get the hang of this. I'm going to try one more. I'm probably going to look very foolish, though. Okay, again, we got to get these all by itself. I think there's kind of a method to my madness here that some things have to be done in order. So I'm thinking like order of operations. You have to do th certain things in a certain order. And I wonder with something like this if we have to do other things first. So I've got this. I'll make that over there. I'll put this over here. I'm going to get this. Make that a one. Yes. Okay. The box is alone and I did it really well. Hooray for me. I'm going to try this again, getting this box all by itself. To me, this looks like it's going to be a little bit a little bit easy. You know what I'm going to do first? Sure, I'm going to do this. I'm going to get rid of these things here. Okay, now I'm going to get rid of this guy here. I'll put it as a denominator. It's saying whatever I do to one side, i got to do to the other. And this becomes that. That's like one box. And looks like I'm doing okay. I'm going to try... This looks kind of complicated, but maybe not. These two are kind of opposite of each other. They might cancel each other out. Yeah, they do. Um, I'm going to put a card over here. 
if I do that, I got to put, see the card is bouncing. Whatever I do on one side, I got to do to the other. These two cancel each other out. Now I'm left with that. I'm going to change the color of the card to make it the same. And I'm going to put it down here as a fraction. Whatever is on the bottom here, I got to do over here. Same thing. This, I'm starting to get the logic of this. Okay, did I get all green checks? Did I get any? Yes. Okay. All righty, let's take a look at this. This, now, now instead of a box, it's an X. I'm going to get rid of that. F is that. I'm going to get rid of that. Make that go away. Make that go away. Put this on the bottom. Put this on the bottom. These two will cancel each other out. That leaves it like with one X, which is the same as X. I think I'm getting the hang of it. Okay. This plus that is going to be zero. Zero. Will I be able to do that? Oh, look at that. Now we're doing with numbers. Okay. If I can say add it here, and I can put this over here, if I combine these, that'll be make it a zero, and I can make that go away. I'm going to make that go away, too. Uh, let's see. If i I got to get X all by itself. So, if I turn these into fractions, and then I do that, that's the same as 1x. Yes. Okay. I'm going to stop now.